your students. Today I'm going to talk about sequence structure and local variables. Sequence structure, we can find it from here. In the block diagram, just right click, expand, and then go to programming, go to structures, and here we can choose the stack sequence structure. What is the stack sequence structure? Stack sequence structure is consists from uh, sub diagrams or frames. Now this is uh, the first frame and uh, how to add other frames. Now you have to just right click and then add frame after. This is the second frame. Right click again, add frame after. This is the third frame. And here we have three frames. Now if you look here to the mouse cursor, if you click here, this is now we have frame zero, this is frame one, this is frame two. And you can, of course, you can add more. So here we have three frames from frame zero to frame two. Now, uh, we need to have a simple example to show how the sequence structure is working. And of course, we will use local variables. Now, imagine that we have uh, two boolean lids or two boolean lights. Now look here, right click in the front panel, choose the lids. This is a round lid. This is, for example, this is uh, light. This is light one. Let me just put it outside and outside of the sequence structure. Now again, the front panel, right click and uh, go to lids. This is the, another round lid. Now here, this is uh, light two. Now we have two lights. This is light one and light two. Let me just move light two a little bit to be in the same level with light one. Now imagine that first thing I want to, I want both lights to light for one second, for example. And of course here we need a delay or wait structure. After that, I need both of them to be off for one second. And the third frame, for example, I want light two to be on and light one to be off. What, 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 what I'm going to do here? Now this is light one and this is, let me just move light two here, for example. Okay, now both of them, I want them to be, uh, to be uh, light uh, on frame number zero or frame, frame zero. So here, how to make them light? Now, this is frame zero, and for example, now what can I do? Now, if I create here a constant, here from numeric, this is a constant. Now, this is a constant, for example, one. Now, this is a Boolean. This is a Boolean uh, lid, and of course, this is a Boolean lid. Now, if I connect directly, I will have error. Why I have error? Look here, because this is a numeric, and this is boolean. We will have a type mismatch. Look here, type mismatch. We have connected two terminals of different types. Look here. So we have a problem here. So what 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 I will do now? Let me just erase the broken uh, connection. Control B. Okay. And here again. Now what I need? I need to use comparators. Look here. How to use comparators? I will use comparator like, for example, look here. Right click. Arithmetic here comparison, for example, greater. Look here. Now one, look here. Look one greater than zero. Create. This is a, a, a constant. This is zero. Now one greater than zero, and let me connect it with light one. Now one greater than zero. This it will give me true. Now all comparators, all comparators like this, greater than, less than, greater than or equal, less than or equal, equal, not equal, all of them will produce true or false. They will produce one or zero. So here one greater than zero, they, this will light. Now also I need this to be light. So also I will connect it here. Also I will connect it here. So both of them will light. This is frame zero. Now uh, they will light for, for example, for one second. So I need a delay or wait. So here, right click, look here, expand, 
go to programming and then this is the timing and last time I use wait here I use wait in millisecond so you can use for example wait in millisecond and you can attach 1000 to this or you can use time delay look here this is a time delay and automatically I will set it to one second look here this is in seconds this is okay so this it will be this frame it will work for one second now now I need to work with the frame second frame which is frame one so here if I just click here this is frame one here and it's empty now both of them both lights will be off now what I'm going to do now now here if I if I want to use these lights I can't now these lights I can these boolean lights I can use them with one frame only one frame only so what can I do now you need to create something called local variable look here now click here on light number one and right click and create this is a local variable look here here click here right click create look here a local variable if you don't want to use if you do don't want to use local variables then you need to use six lights you got it you need to use six lights two lights for every frame so since we need and we need we need six different lights imagine that we don't want to use this we want to use the same uh, lights the same lights the same two lights I don't want to have more lights now this is a frame one now what I'm going to do both of them is will be off both of them will be off so here here I need uh, look here the same I need a constant and let me use here a zero and what I will say what I will say if you can imagine what I, I will do greater greater than what greater than zero Look. So zero greater than zero, it's, well, what it will be? Zero greater than zero, it will be false. Look here, I will connect them here like this. So both of them will be off. I need, of course, let me just expand. Look here, let me just ma maximize the, uh, the, the stack sequence structure. I can move the tunnel here. This is called the tunnel. So now look here right click I need also the wait or the delay the delay time programming this is the timing this is the time delay this is the time delay and here this is one second so now both of them will be off for one second now what about the third frame look here the third frame in the third frame for example suppose that I want light 2 to be on and light 1 to be off so what, what, what I'm going to do now here I can I can use here now this I want it to be on so uh, again I will use the same look here greater than for example look here and here create a constant this is here this is uh, one one greater than zero create a constant one greater than zero and here it seems that I forget the local variables so here uh, let me just to create a local variables this is a local variable okay for light one and here right click create a local variable for light two okay now I need light one let me just move these look here move these now one greater than zero this is a true so light two I want it to be on so this will be on and now this I want it to be off so what, what I'm going to use now here now I can use here another comparator here to here greater for example you can use different comparators and here you can use create a constant this is zero and here you can use this you can use this zero here you can use it here now one greater than zero this will light now zero greater than zero this will be off here and of course we need we need uh, a delay so programming timing and this is the time delay for one second 
that's it look here now let me just run it now if you run it look if you run it again let me run it continuous look here these two on these two off this on look here can you look here now both on both off and the right on look here again again now both on both off the light two is on that's it it will be like this now if i want if i want to this to be continue i can put, put it inside a while loop look here right click here i can use it from here by the way this is the while loop i can put it inside a while loop okay and i can run it look Both of the light two on, both on, both of the light two on, both on, both of the light on, two on, that's it. Thank you very much for your listening. Thank you.